Trezino, good to see you. Um, Morning. This 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 losing thing. You know, you're not used to losing very much. What, 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 what was it like for you? You know, having to have to take these setbacks recently. Uh, crazy, uh, strange, but um, that's another opportunity to get back on track. And yeah, I'm happy and I'm I'm here that I had this quick turnaround. Nice. What were the lessons you took out of the last one, right? Because you know the Naganu fight, like things just happen, right? But that one, you 25 minutes, you got to play it out. So what lessons did you take out of that? Nah, I mean, I, I have to be the first guy for this fight. Doesn't matter what's gonna happen, how it's gonna happen. I have to be the first guy uh, pushing backwards. Uh, nah. But this fight's gonna be uh, excited. Nice. So you think it's more just like a like a mental adjustment that you have to make versus like tactical or or a, you know a fight strategy adjustment? So uh, maybe, maybe not. It was a little bit strange. I don't even know what happened. Like, uh, and it happened so fast. So it was crazy. I mean, after the fight, I was like. What happened, you know? But as I say, I'm here and I'm ready to do it all over again and and, and do it better. Nice. What has been the uh, the focus since? What what's been the focus in training? Uh, the focus being um, being more mobile, faster at movement, and, um, pressure forward. I'm the most dangerous guy if I go forward, backwards I can hit someone, knock somebody out. But forward is dangerous, so focusing more on that. It's kind of an interesting balance in the heavyweight division, right? Speed versus power. Is that like a, is that like a kind of a conversation you have to have with yourself on which matters more? Sometimes it's that, but I'm able to do both, so, yeah. Nice. But they bring you back in a big, big opportunity, a big fight, main event. I mean, uh, does, that, does that mean something to you? Yeah, it means something to me. Bring my name bigger and, and better in the, on the platform. Uh, spread the word all over all over the world, and and right now, uh, main event is a big opportunity. That means the UFC take me serious, and I have to take this fight serious. So I'm gonna go in there and put this crazy performance for the fans, family, and also for the UFC. Nice. You clearly fought the best in the world. Um, what do you think about Augusto? I mean, is he is he one of the best in the world? Does he measure up to those people that you fought? I mean, he's he's he's, the, he's, the, he's in the top 15. So he's a big deal. That's how I take him, serious. Yeah. Is there anything that he does that you see that's special or unique? I mean, obviously, everybody at heavyweight can knock people out. Uh, d does he do anything that concerns you the most? No, uh, I'm not going to say concern, concern but uh, he does his thing. He's moved forward, and, and I'm going to be able to move and, and, and stop him there or see where it goes. Nice. And last thing for me, I guess, to go here, I mean, you want to win, but is it just win by any means necessary, or is it win and show people that hey, I'm I'm that guy, you know, I'm still that dangerous guy, that top contender guy. Uh, for me, a win is the most important thing, and and the, the crazy performance is the second. So, a win in any way, so it doesn't matter how. You mentioned putting on a show for the fans, and there aren't going to be any fans in the in the crowd. Is there any desire to get back to performing in front of fans? Uh, of course I want to perform for the fans, it's crazy and, and it's a long time, it's almost two years that's passed, but uh, I know everybody's watching from the television, computers, the streaming from everywhere, all, all over the world, so that's what I meant. And a lot of uh, fighters have talked about how they prefer fighting without fans because they can hear their coaches, it's a little quieter, and more intimate, is that how you feel or do you feel like you perform better with crowd? No, for me it doesn't matter, I mean, being in the octagon, do what you have to do. Uh, with fans, it's fine. Without fans, it's also fine. And just go in there and do my job, and that's it.